everyone, it's Daisy59 here, and today I'm going to be giving you a haul, and I'm going like this, because I have a bag here and a bag here. So, yeah. If you saw what those bags are, then you probably know what kind of things are coming to you. But yeah, so we're going to start with winners, and here's the bag. And it just says winners on it. Winners.ca. You can recycle the bag. Whatever. And so I got some socks. Just these random gray socks. Like that. These probably can't. So I'll just put them. So yeah. Um, next, I have knee socks, so as you can see, they do go up to my knee, and so yeah, I'm going to get these, and um, so this is a two-pack, yeah, this is a two-pack, and it was $7.00 pairs look like seven dollars and they were on for sale they were originally I don't know because it's covered up then I have these and these are size 19 um these were 10 9.99 and they were not on for sale and they're one size fits all it says I can just put those there as well. Then I got some pants. And, oh, where is the tag? These are flints, not lined. And I guess I should have. These were $9.99. And they're super soft. Wait, here, maybe I should read this part. I don't know if it ripped it off. Probably did. Um, yeah, I did. But this is large, 14 to 16, and it looks like that. And so it has, like, that kind of, like, Christmas pattern. And they're very fuzzy on the inside here. You can even see the fuzz. I can tell that that's fuzzy. And then on the outside, it is just very warm. And I'm going to wear these tomorrow. And I'm going to wear these socks tomorrow with a white shirt and a gray sweater. And um, for our Thanksgiving... Um, I forget what it's called. For our Thanksgiving feast? Is that what it's called? I don't know. Then I got these new shoes because I've been wearing my mom's. I'm going to keep hers, but they're going to be my outdoor shoes, and these are going to be for, like, indoor. And these are called Bees Naturalizer, and these were $49.99. And they're just all black. Like that. And, yeah, they are very comfortable. There's, like, a cushion here. Like, a very, like... Like, it's, like, cushiony on the sides, on the inside, on the top. Like, it's all, like, cushion. And they are size 9. I am size 8.5, but I like that they fit kind of, like, big. So, yeah, I got that stuff there from Winners. <clears throat> now, from Staples, I got... Three folders for school, so I got red, orange, and yellow. So, um, I have those owl stickers that if you guys see the drawing video I have, and there is a, like, where is it? Like, that box thing right here. You guys probably can't see it on camera, but there is a box right here. Whoa. Yeah, there, oh yeah, you can kind of see the line there. Yeah, right there, you guys. You kind of see it, but yeah, it is there, and I'm probably, you're supposed to put your name there. 
And these were on clearance for like 47 cents. And they're just normal duo tanks, but they have pockets. So I have red, that, um, yellow, and orange. And these were seven, 47 cents for each one. Then, I'm going to be doing a whole separate video on this. Just... Whoa. Where um, I got this from Staples a while ago for school. I also got those pencil, like sketch pencils, 6B, 8B pencils, and we have to do a couple of sketches for um, an assignment. And he said that we're gonna. Um, I our teacher said we might even um, that this the probably gonna get filled with sketches by the end of the year. We I think. We probably might need another one. The back is all dirty. You can see it from my hands, from like rubbing on the paper and then holding my book. So yeah, I'm probably going to need to erase my actual cover part. Just the reason why I'm not really putting it on my floor. <laughs> but yeah, so I got, um, so my friend had, um, an eraser for it, but hers came in a pack with her pencils, and I couldn't really buy that all again, because I was like, it was like $20 for it, so I wasn't going to spend $20 when I already had the thing, when I already had the pencils, um, if I already had the pencils, and the only thing I need in that pack is the eraser, there's no point in that, so we went back there, and I found this, and I'm like, I can show you, this is after using it all, Looks like this. Um, this isn't one of them, but as you can see, they can stretch like gum. They do look like gum, pretty much. Yeah, they do look like gum. And, but they start off, um, white, but then as you put it on, like, here, I can show you what color they started off as. That color right there. Um, they started off as that color, but then, um, basically, what, this is what I do that works really well. Um, you can just erase like this with them, like as a normal eraser. But normally, what I do is, by the way, they're normally bigger than this. This is just like a sample size that I got. So what you do is I normally rip like that much off of it. That much off of it. And that's how much I started with. And so I take this, and then I form it. So let's say I have a, just a thin line that I need to get rid of. Or like a thick line. I would roll it out like that, and I would place it on my paper. Like, let's say, um, let's say this is my paper, and I this is where the mistake is. I put it on there, and I just wait until it gets like darker well and then I peel it off and then it's normally gone and the reason why it's darker is because it like um, absorbs the pencil so it's really cool and I like I, I remember we were watching this movie the entire movie I just kept on doing this not that sorry not that um like that just ripping it in half like that Yeah, I just kept on ripping it and then putting it back together. So yeah, let me just put this on here. I should get like a little container for them. I probably should do that. I'm just putting it right there for now. And it, it feels like Play-Doh. Well, it doesn't feel like Play-Doh actually. It feels like sticky tack. So yeah, I got this one. And this is Art Erasers. And so I have a... Stedler, yeah, I have a Stedler USA, um, well, it says, it's, it's a Stedler eraser, and then I have a Karat eraser, and so I didn't know what those were, it's just one of them looks like what, um, my friend had, so there's 
this one with this statue and it's the karat. And then so I was reading the back and it says, um, can edible erasers. And so which one? I don't know which one's edible. It doesn't say. But it says is a soft, um, pliable eraser needs to any shape so you can like need it to any shape. Idea for lighting for highlighting chalks, um, charcoals and pastels. Great for cleaning artwork and film. And then the art gum eraser is soft and pliable gum eraser um, cleaner. It's eraser slash cleaner, which cleans and erases gently without damaging the drawing surface. So these are both really good for sketching.